Hi everybody, it's Bonnie Jean from BonnieJean.com. Welcome back to today's video. Now I sound like I'm losing my voice, but that simply is not the case. What is wrong here is that I had a lot of pain last night and I was unable to sleep. And I also got a new addition to the family who failed to realize that there is a certain sleeping period in this house. So I was up for, you know, a little bit of the evening taking care of my brand new friend. Now what I'm referring to here is this little thing called the Shorty. She's situated on my arm right now, see her? She is the cutest little thing and she is my new addition to the family. She's a cross between a Shizu and a Yorkshire Terrier and she will get a little bit bigger than this but hopefully not too much because I love small dogs. But this was a present that the partner felt that I needed after the bad information that I got from the doctor yesterday. So this was my um, present to make me feel a lot better. Now she is uh, a Coco to me. She looks like a Coco, but the partner thinks she looks more like a Dinky. Uh, and I think that's a funky little name. <laughs> so if you could come out with a different name for her, please help me name this little cutie pie. One of the reasons why I didn't want to name her so quick is because I don't know her personality. She seems to be very affectionate, very playful. She has stuffed toys already. She's already being spoiled and she hasn't even been here a full 24 hours. I will be ordering her a puppy apartment later this afternoon, which is a combination of a bed and a place for her to go potty because it's a little bit too cold for her to go outside. She's five weeks old. I don't know much about Shorkies, and I sure, certainly don't know much about five-week-old puppies, so I have to learn how to take care of this beautiful thing. But um, she seems to like the milk that we're giving her, and I'm warming it up just like it would be, you know, coming from her mama. So I'm her brand new mommy right now. So this is just absolutely amazing. I haven't had a doggy in the house here now for almost three years since our poodle passed, and this little tight here I have no no problem whatsoever thinking that she's definitely going to fill a void. I originally was going to produce a video today to show you seven different types of videos that you could produce if you did not want to sit in front of the camera. So unfortunately thanks to this little girl here we won't be producing that video today but I'll definitely get it into your hands by the end of the week. So until then you take care, be safe, have fun and I'll talk to you in the next video.